This video is produced by the Martian Artifact Research Society. Since its purpose is strictly educational in nature, it may be copied and used freely. The opinions expressed here do not necessarily represent those of NASA or JPL, although they should. Your announcer has a speech defect due to an illness. Please be patient. Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and thank you for viewing this presentation of the Martian Artifact Research Society. Tonight's presentation is of Spirit Soul 187, and we're going to get right to it. This photo shows an unusual tunnel, you can see it right here at the cursor. We're going to zoom in 400%, and take a real good close look at this. Now here we have the tunnel, as I just said. The reason we know this is a tunnel is, you can see a ridge falls along just like that. It's actually a pretty good line. And we can see that this is different from the background here, so that we know we're looking at a ridge. But that's not the only thing that distinguishes this. First of all, we can see something inside here as if there's some sort of machinery or other manufactured objects inside of it. I suspect there is. And we're going to look along here. I may tweak the lighting a little bit. I think I will. That's too much. Alright, I just tweaked the contrast on the lighting and try to show this. This looks like a concrete structure of some sort. You can see lots and lots of holes. Actually, triangular holes. Well, something was built there a long time ago. And again, here on this side, we see something different. Looks like some sort of uh, concrete structure right in here and in here. So I think what we have here is a carefully created structure of some sort. Obviously related to the tunnel, what we see here. So that's good. Up here, I'm just going to show this real quickly. You can decipher yourself if there's anything there. I'm not going to say a word about it. I'm going to have to move along because I have another part of this presentation. I can't go over 10 minutes. Right here, another interesting feature. Once again, make up your own mind about it. And we're going to move along, we're going to move down. Another interesting object. Probably not natural, but we don't know that. Now we're going to look at cream of the crop here, as far as a couple of interesting close objects. I'm going to bring the lighting back to where it was. Take a look at this. In here we have a white pipe kind of goes to the up and to the right. And out of it, here we have a clear image of a pipe that attaches to it. So in other words, this goes at a right angle. You can even see a flange. And we see part of whatever it is that it's feeding right here. And then yet another pipe down here is more in shadows. Is that natural? No, it's not. No possibility. So let's take a look at one more object, which is a little on the odd side. Uh, this appears to be a little Tweety Bird perched on a rock. I don't think that's what it is. It's an anomaly to say the least. 
Alright, there's one more anomaly. This kind of looks like a box. Could be, I don't know. Uh, but it is. It's been sitting there a long time, it's all deformed. I measured the angles and they're not at 90 degrees. More, and finally probably a pipe right here. Alright, we're going to close this out, and we're going to look at any earth structure which doesn't, which looks natural and isn't. And we're going to compare it a little bit. Take one more look, we have a little square here. That wasn't produced by nature. Alrighty, we're closing it out. What you're viewing here is an artificial feature at Hemlock Lake. New York. Can you tell well, this is artificial from here? No, you can't. So we're going to take a closer look. Okay, here we're looking upwards. Still can't tell if this is artificial. As far as we know, this could be natural, right? So we're going to go up to the next two pictures. Voila! Here we go. Here's a pipe that leads down into the tank, which forms the artificial basis for this little hill. You see, the Martian photo shows many features that don't look natural. This little hill only shows one. This little pipe sticking out of it. And we know it isn't natural because we have this one little bit of evidence. And the Martian one shows far more evidence than this little pipe. And that's the point. If you're going to take into account Earth evidence, then you have to take into account Mars evidence. And you have to weigh it the same. The concrete structures that I showed, that that's what they're made of, can't simply be brushed off as boulders or something when they don't fit the pattern. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I thank you for your kind attention. I would ask you to put pressure on our lawmakers to put pressure on NASA to tell us the truth. Thank you and have a good night.